a lot of people today still rely on focusing just on uh, the classical technical analysis and looking at things that have that have taken place over the past decades or so there has been considerable progress that's made on the technological front so today we are in the world of automation algorithmic trading high frequency trading etc but in a country like india a lot of people today still rely on uh, focusing just on the classical uh, technical analysis going forward in time uh, do you see the demand for classical technical analysis will still prevail or do you see there being uh, an eventual uh, evolution towards more con driven technical analysis yes quantitative uh, finance may be new to india but it's uh, existed uh, in the west and uh, the more developed nations in uh, in asia for a long time uh, as i heard uh, uh, one of the speakers from uh, the early morning uh, session i kind of could relate to what he was saying and you know what he said was really interesting and that was that um, uh, when you say i'm do, you know i'm i'm doing quant what is the core input into that model it's price exactly and uh, who determines price the collective psychology of people like you and me i mean yes. uh, could be a retailer who's thinking a certain stock uh, is headed higher could be an institution looking at that same stock at the same time and thinking it's going to go lower uh, could be uh, could be a housewife sitting at home who doesn't have a view but she finds the debate interesting and therefore decides to take a view depending on what her assessment of uh, that price action is uh, so regardless of you know what kind of models are being deployed in the in the present era uh to throw whatever complicated output uh, which which eventually comes out in the end uh the the core ingredient that goes into that model is price and uh as long as that continues to be the uh, core input i see absolutely no reason to worry about uh, uh how technical analysis is evolving into more quant driven strategies and so on and so forth so Yeah, I'm still so a believer still in classical, classical analysis. Absolutely, it is here to stay. Great.